hello YouTube. I'm coming to do a updated video on the Jamaican black castor oil. I did a video one month ago and I told you I will come back with the results of using the Jamaican black castor oil. I was my focus was my was this area. This area was really thinning and being that I have been using it for a month, it has really helped with this area of my hair. I will insert a picture of what my edges look like. Um, what I have been doing is putting the casserole on my edges and, mass and massaging my scalp. And also, I've been putting it in this, putting it through my scalp like that. Um, I put it on my scalp like that at least once a week, but I was putting it on my edges at least four, four to five times a week. Um, so this stuff is the bomb. If any of you are experiencing any thinning areas in your hair, I would definitely suggest you try Jamaican black castor oil and also, I'm planning to put the castor oil in my conditioner because when I co-wash my hair, I massage my hair. And when you massage your hair, that stimulates hair growth. So, to be massaging your hair with castor oil, that's like a double dose of, you know, your hair growing. So, I'm hoping to see results with that. Um, also, before I go, I wanted you all to see my hair in a ponytail. I've never been able to do a ponytail until now. This is what my ponytail looks like. Today is actually, is actually my wash day, so I'm about to, to, to take it down, but I wanted you all to see it. Um, so I'm happy to be able to get my hair in a ponytail because the last time I tried a ponytail, I had to have some clips to clip certain areas thank god i do not need that i can just get a ouchless band and put my hair in a ponytail without the extra help so if any of you have went through the big chop phase and you was able to put your hair in a ponytail that is a milestone so hooray for me in a way i hope that this the video was helpful. Please let me know if you have any questions in the comment box. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.